Hey vlog. Mexico! These guys were up dancing last night until the wee hours of the morning. Did you bring your fruit to bed? Go Katie, go! I look a fright, you guys. Good morning. It is the day after New Year's Eve, and we are on a cruise ship in Cozumel, Mexico. And this... <laughs> wait, look at there's a Happy New Year hat. These guys were up dancing last night until the wee hours of the morning. What time did you go to bed? I, don't even know. I have a story for you. What's that? This morning, Dad and I got up and went and got coffee. Uh. And this woman came over to me. She goes, are you the mother of the boy that was dancing with the red velvet jacket last night on deck 12? And I said, yes. She said, he was the life of the party. <laughs> we were up there looking down and we just could not take our eyes off him. He was having a great time. Shut up. I swear to goodness. She said that. Ask dad. Ask dad. Isn't that funny? Yeah. Now I have the lady that uh, came on TC days ago. Said I was best dressed kid. Oh, did she go up to you again? No, 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 no. But I'm just talking about like. Oh, right, yes. The accolades, the numbers I'm putting up. <laughs> you're, you're rocking the equinox. Exactly. Mm hmm. This is, this is, uh, <laughs> I'm not sure why there are shoes on the dinner plates, but I think. You know, and oh gosh, you guys, again, I look a fright. I shouldn't even. Admit, but remember, cruise ships used to did do. You say I look a fright. I did. I do look a fright. Um, cruise ships used to do these like midnight buffets with like, um, um, what do you call it? Ice sculptures and all that stuff. They don't do that anymore. They just open up the um, portions, I would say, right, of the buffet, yeah. right? So last night, Mike and I went up and we got some cheese quesadillas and I got a salad. <laughs> Dad got um, French fries, but you guys, it looks like you got a hamburger or a cheeseburger. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And some fruit. That's, this is definitely Katie's plate. Uh -huh. This is definitely Ryan's plate. It's pretty disgusting. If you don't look at it. Yeah. And Brennan didn't get anything. I don't think he said. Oh, Katie, look at you. Did you bring your fruit to bed? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. I laid down on the floor and scratched Katie's arm for 30 <gasps> minutes last night as she fell asleep. You're so sweet. I swear, it was, yeah, it was very You're sweet. a very good brother. All right. Well, that was fun. Did you guys have a good time last night? Of course. Brennan, yes? Of course, you guys met a ton of people on the ship, so that sounds good. All right. I'm going to... Um I'm going to say goodbye for now. We are in Cozumel, Mexico. It is a beautiful, beautiful sunny day. I think we're going to go on a catamaran. You guys want to go on a catamaran? What time? Oh, actually? Yeah. Yeah. Time? Yeah, 1 o'clock. Yes. We have to be down there at 1230. No. Bet. Okay, bet, then you bet, can bet, stay bet, here. Bet, bet. Wait, yeah, what you went. Let's go and catch. What? The sun is good at one o'clock. You don't think there's going to be sun on the catamaran? <laughs> Bye. That's all good. All right, breakfast time it is. Oh, <laughs> Ryan decided to wear his bathrobe, Mike, to the breakfast. I yeah, and his slippers. He thinks that he's. He thinks he's like bougie, but like, <laughs> it's just weird. <laughs> it's weird. <laughs> Okay, that's Ryan's breakfast, Dad's breakfast, Kate's breakfast, Mom's breakfast. Is Brennan is Brennan joining us? Brennan may or may not be joining us. Oh jeez. What do I say? I'm not sure. Well, I'll you can. <laughs> mm. mm. I tried to speak, Mom. I need to mouthwash. Hey vlog. <laughs> this is how you eat salmon. First. Smoke salmon. <laughs> Smoke salmon. First, take your salmon. <laughs> Lay it down. Uh, uh, then we're gonna spread the cream oh, cheese. Oh. <laughs> hey, so clean with it. And then throw capers on top. Watch this. This is this is like the best part. Roll it up. Oh no! Roll yeah. it up. Yes. Then it's like sushi. It's like salmon. No, no. Then you give it a little slice. Like that. Mm, nice. That's gal. 
All right, you guys, every year they do a New Year's cake. This one is the 2024. Look at that. Thank you. Happy New Year to you. Thank you. Mexico. So this is the deal we're getting off the ship and the boys are having a little bit of water. This is the celebrity constellation right next to us. We are the celebrity equinox heading into Cozumel. Now, I'm gonna share this with you guys, not to brag. Like, this is not a brag session. This is just like a holy cow. Every time we go on a cruise, generally, we have been to Cozumel. That's really true. <laughs> we saw the Cozumel. So we've been it's here like our, five uh, times. It's our port. Yeah. We so we've tried almost everything there is to do in Cozumel, including the last time we were here, we had a tour guide who took us all around. We've been to the a special beach on here, like a beach club. We've done, um, what do they call it? Snorkeling? No, the. Uh, head, we, we walked out of water with big helmets. Yeah, we're, what's that called? Scuba diving, like sort of scuba thing. We have been to Senior Frogs. So this we, time. We went, uh, saw how they made like tequila and they got a history tour. We love went Cozumel. To other beach. If you're from Cozumel, comment down below. Probably not a lot of people from no, Cozumel are watching. But, but anyway, so we love Cozumel. So this time we've decided to go on a catamaran. Tour. Like we're going to go on a catamaran, switch it up, do a little bit of snorkeling and go to a beach and that kind of thing. So this is, I think, probably the last thing left to do in Cozumel. <laughs> Honestly. And we've done it all. Check. <laughs> The great yellow sun is reflecting in your deep blue eyes. The day has begun. You spin around, you spin around, you laugh to yourself. And I see you shining every... There's our boat. That's where we're going. Oh, you guys are such troublemakers. We just got all the instructions on our snorkel, our snorkel adventure. Katie's gonna soak up a little bit of sun before we get in. Apparently this is the world's second largest reef. Look at the color of that water. It is spectacular. I'm gonna go over here and show you. There are people in the water right now snorkeling. I think we're gonna go join them. Oh, the water. Oh, sun feels good, Kate. Sun feels good. Let's go. Amigos, we're here. We're about to enter the water. next part of our tour they have marooned our boat on a very secluded beach and there go Brennan, Katie and Ryan right over there going to secure some type of chair I'm sure look at there are water games and slides I guess it's called a water park something like that and there's food and drink massages souvenirs Michael this is like paradise man Time to get off the boat. You ready? Woo! All right, here we go. Hey, thank you. Hello, everybody. <laughs> thank you.
she came from behind. I don't know how you did it, Katie. How did you beat Brendan and Ryan? You were in the in the last she place for a very she, long time. She was actually a 12 and a half second. What point. happened? Also, honestly, like I came into this race thinking, you know, I have a I have a disadvantage, right? So like, what's your disadvantage? Well, I'm a girl, so wait a minute. That's I'm not a, a, no, that's not a disadvantage. One less physical than the boys. Okay. I got a strapless bathing suit on. Oh, I see. That's that's so, a disadvantage. But honestly, like after like after the first uh, rock climb, I was kind of like, you know what? This is just gonna be fun again for me. You know, like it's just a test run. It's a practice run. Um, it's like not as safe as like. You know, like you championship, know, championships. Okay. Thank you, Katie. Alright, that was awesome. Back you know, to you, Bob. The young, the young, the young buck, all skill, gotta give it tough everybody. Mike has challenged Ryan to a duel or a race. So they're gonna go up there. They have to climb up there, go down here, across here, and then down. And whoever wins, wins $10. I can't see from the other side. I guess I could go over there. And there are no rules, by the way. They're allowed to push each other off, which is, looks like is what they're doing. Here goes Ryan. Huh? Mike's making his way. Oh wow, he's losing by a lot. <laughs> Ryan's already on the inside. Michael! Here he goes. Good job. You never know though, Katie came from behind last time. Ryan's climbing up. Come on, Mike. Oh, Mike fell off. Oh, there goes Ryan. Climbing up the last one. Oh, no, he's getting stuck. Oh, here comes Mike. Oh, shoot. 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 Oh,
cuz him out if you think you've done everything. You haven't. Do the Fury Catamaran Tour. That was, it was a little bit of everything. Right when it was time to be done with one thing, we went to the next thing, which is how Mike likes to roll, right? Yes. You don't like to stay any place very long. Totally fun. Yes, it was awesome. All right, back to the boat. I'm hungry. We're going to go get some hamburgers at the Mast Grill. Why not? Sound good? Why not? And French fries, Mike's favorite food. And gear up for tonight. Woo! I beat the boys to burgers. They thought they were cool. Oh my gosh, this is such a good burger. Thank you so much. Uh, Thousand with cheeseburger, please. Maybe just can't hear me through there. I'm gonna tell you that we're at dinner now. We've missed a lot of time between when you saw us before and when you saw us now. When we got back off the ship, or when we got back on the ship after being in Cozumel, um, the four of these guys played euchre. I took a nap. We did eat. We ate hamburgers. I don't know if I showed you that. Maybe I did. I'm not sure. But then everybody kind of slept, and then we came to dinner. And it's going to be an early night tonight because we are exhausted. But let me show you what we got for dinner. Ryan, Brendan, and I are splitting this and the sirloin steak. Ryan got, oh wow, that looks so good. Mike got the salmon. Delicious. Good. Katie Delicious. got the salmon again. All right, bon appetit, everybody. Thank you. You're welcome. Sorry, guys, I took a bite of this before I filmed it. It's panna cotta. So good. Apple pie on the extra ice cream. Angry viewers. Say what? Angry viewers? I think I you might be right, because that's not what it's supposed to look like. Apple pie on the Michael John? Crème brûlée. Crème brûlée. Uh, ice cream. Oh, Brendan, sorry. Huh. I, caught, I caught that right on video. Yeah, that's good. I have a country part. <laughs> Log yeah, cake, top, top. coffee, ice cream, and some type of grilled banana. Yeah. Let's try it. We've decided to call it a night. We had a big day in Cozumel today, and everybody's exhausted. Great day. So I think we're gonna go to bed kind of early. Well, it's early. It's not really that early. It's it midnight. It's midnight, <laughs> which we feel like we're giving up, but it's midnight. I don't know why. I said to Mike, I don't want to go to bed yet because I know when I go to bed, I only have one day of the cruise left. But I have to go to bed because I'm exhausted. But anyway, so hopefully we're gonna go to bed tonight fairly early and get a good night's sleep and wake up tomorrow morning, do our workout, and try to make it to breakfast. Anything about that? It's gonna be a great day tomorrow. It is gonna be a great day tomorrow. So let me show you what I was just saying to Mike. There's I I, need, I was thinking about this today. I want to do a top ten reasons why I love cruising. Oh, right. what I, top ten what I love about cruising. Right. I might turn that into like a TikTok or an Instagram. I'll let me. You know, we all let you guys know that, but I was thinking today what those things are, and I want to make sure I want to write them down so make sure I get pictures or videos of each one of those things yeah. so I can share them with you guys. So stay tuned for that. But I will give you a hint. One of them is this. Hey right, guys, I'm looking over the side of my balcony, and the sound of the waves. It, well, first of all, I don't want to put my phone over there. I'm so nervous about that. But anyway, the sound of the waves is just spectacular and. That is what we sleep to every night. So that is definitely one of the top 10 things I love about cruising. What made me happy today was our amazing trip to Cozumel. It was fantastic. And um, just family time in Cozumel was ridiculous. Brendan, Katie, and Ryan are watching the Washington versus Texas football game. What made you happy today, babe? Son and Alabama losing. Oh, okay. Ryan, I already fell asleep. I'm not gonna ask him. What made you happy today, Kate? Um, being with my family on the catamaran. I totally agree. That was awesome. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Comment down below. What made you guys happy today? And we have one more day of cruise vlogging. See you guys later.